Good morning loves and happy Sunday. I hope you guys are all doing well today. So guys, in today's video, we are actually on our way to brunch. We are going to meet uh, my friend at 10 o'clock. Uh, the time right now is about like 9.30. I will show you guys what I'm wearing and then we'll go ahead and head out. So let's get started. This is the outfit for today. I do have like on these mom like distressed jeans with this cute little uh, shirt that I ended up getting from Nordstrom's. The shirt is actually by Topshop. And the jeans uh, came from Nordstrom's. I'm just not sure what the brand is. And then I have on my little black um, heels. And then I am wearing my black Teddy Blake today. I'm wearing a different type of necklace today. I just want to do something different. I did get this necklace from H&M as well. And I did curl my hair last night. So this is the look. And I actually tied the shirt up in the front. And it actually is down in the back. So this is today's look. I want you guys to let me know what do you guys think of this look. I think it looks super cute for a little brunch on a Sunday. I definitely want to take pictures. So let's go ahead and head out. Seven and a half, Ronnie said, and to me, I rated about a seven. It was pretty good, but right now we are in Nordstrom's. I'm um, looking at some perfumes. Got my girl Ronnie over there. <laughs> Cute. <laughs> and I want to see if they got some more jeans on sale because the jeans that I'm wearing today, y'all, I got them for like seven dollars. They was on sale, so I want to see if I can find some more jeans and some more shirts, and then maybe like some sweater dresses for when I go out of town. So I'm gonna see y'all in a minute.
tell me what's wrong and why you never said you felt that way And guess you're trying to stay strong and fake a smile until I look away But I've known you too long, it hurts to watch your blue eyes fade to grey As you fade away, yeah, 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 yeah. As you fade away Hey guys and welcome to a new day um the time right now is almost seven o'clock um i did decide to go ahead and um start vlogging today um so i'm basically wanting to go get some sd cards for um content also i am dressed for the day i will show you guys what i'm wearing here in a minute but i got the camera propped up right now um because i'm about to take a return back to nordstrom's yeah i got these super cute boots from nordstrom's y'all and I don't know what it is. Maybe the floor was just different there. But like when I came home and like actually walked in the boot, it was like a little too narrow for my foot. But let me show y'all real quick. I'm gonna actually take those back. And then I might go to Trader Joe's and get some food and stuff for the house. But let me show y'all the boots real quick. So this is the bag right here. Now, remember I was telling y'all that I had needed some shoes for like the fall time. And I was telling y'all, um, and we had went into DSW, but I couldn't find anything. So like I didn't stress it. So, girl, when me and my friend was in Nordstrom yesterday, I had came across these cute boots right here. So, this is how they look. Like, how stinking cute. Like, are you serious? These boots were only $39.99, okay? But it's this type of boot that I'm kind of looking for. I mean, not necessarily, but just like this type of style. Um, and I kind of want like a little platform heel. I did think these was really cute. Um, I hadn't seen anything like this before. And I was just like, I just love these. They're so cute. I did get these in a size 10. But like I said, they're very narrow. So I'm just going to have to take them back today. And I might try to look for some more. Um, but I pretty much had rambled through all their boots yesterday. And these was the only ones that I feel like was like, you know, like a decent little price. And um, stuff like that. But like I said, these are at the 10. But how cute are these? I will be taking these back today. Um, I just love these. I'm sorry that they don't really fit that well because I just feel like these will go with my little jeans that I got yesterday and my little skirt. But let me show y'all what, what else I got yesterday. So Nordstrom did have a little sale yesterday and it had like 70% off of everything. So y'all, I ended up coming across these really cute Levi Wedged jeans. And y'all, I had got these for like $11 and they in a size 32. And um, they're like the Wedged jeans. So they kind of like look like capris. But this is how they look like. They're so cute. They're like Levi jeans. And y'all, I got these for like 11 and something dollars yesterday. Y'all, they so cute. And it's like a wedgie jean. So this is how they look really cute. And y'all, when I had looked at these online on the website, these was $98 on a Levi website. And girl, I got them for $11 and some change. Like, are you kidding? Like, so super cute. And these are the ones that like hug like your hips. Um and like your waist and stuff so they like hug you really really nice so i ended up getting these from um nordstrom yesterday and then i got a skirt for like five dollars and change them share real quick so i ended up coming across this really cute um skirt that was also 70 percent off as well so it's just like a little um black sweater skirt and it does come out like this and then you like tie it like on the edges like super super cute and it has like the other string where you just like tie it on the other side um when i seen this skirt immediately i grabbed it because i've been looking for a like sweater skirt for a minute and the fact that it was black lets me know that it was like meant for me and i love the fact that it's like a long length i would like to try this on for y'all but i think i'm gonna have to do that another day um i do want to start doing like clothing hauls and stuff so i want you guys to comment and let me know do you guys um want for me to do like a little fall clothing haul um or like fall like essentials and stuff like that but um, we are just for the day. I'm about to go ahead and head out. I just want to introduce the vlog and just show you guys what I ended up getting from Nordstrom just today because we're going to have to take these boots back today. But the skirt and the pants, obviously, I'm keeping. And I do want to show y'all how I um, put those little looks together. Um, and I got my little clothing rack right here for when I do like show y'all a little like, you know, fall stuff that I, you know, wear in the fall and stuff like that because y'all know I love to dress. But we about to go ahead and head out. Um, I just got finished doing my hair and stuff. And y'all, uh, the wet and like the weather right now is like probably like 60 something degrees. So I think today is gonna be the first day that I actually wear like 
a little like maybe like pea jacket or something so i'm excited i think i might wear this jacket right here um just to keep it like lightweight so i think i'm gonna do this one because i feel like it's thin enough and it's not super heavy and it actually has like a little belt to go on it too as well this jacket ended up coming from um this came from tj maxx i think i got this last year but it's like a pretty like uh peanut butter color definitely in time for right, so this is the outfit for today i have on this really cute like white turtleneck with these little straight leg blue jeans and then i have like my little black booties on to go with it and then also this is the peanut butter little jacket that i end up getting from tj maxx i am wearing my teddy blake right there as you guys can see so i'll be wearing that purse and this is the outfit of today now let's head to the car So yeah, we end up coming to Starbucks because I had to grab something to eat real quick. I actually, um, I haven't really ate all day today, so I just want to come and grab a little grilled cheese and a little um, drink real quick. I got my grilled cheese right here. But I think I want to hit this good with us out here too as well. This is the drink that I got, which is the, um, the caramel ribbon crunch. So yeah, this is the drink that I got, but I wanted to try to hit a good one real quick. Um, they all close at nine o'clock though. So I might not make that. So yeah. But um let's go ahead and head out. Like I said, I started the vlog pretty late today. Um, we will probably be doing the front porch in this video as well. So I'm very excited for that. Cause I'm just ready to get all this fall decor out the way, honey. This fall decor can be a little overwhelming. But um I'm about to try to probably either um, go to Kroger's. And if I got enough time, I'll probably go to um, the Goodwill because the Goodwill do close at 9 o'clock, but I know it's close to this area. But I really need to get some stuff from Kroger, so I think that's what I'll do first. So I'll see you in a minute.
Hey loves and welcome to a brand new day guys. So in today's video we are going to be doing a little decor haul. I do want to show you guys the things that I do plan on putting on the front porch because I do want to decorate in today's video too as well. Our little front porch for the uh, fall season. So let's go ahead and get started. So the first thing I do want to start with is this reef. So this is the reef that we will be using today for our door. Super cute. I did get this reef from I believe Burlington and this reef was I think it was $25 for this reef so this is the reef that we're going to be using super cute with the pumpkins you know I love the pop of orange because y'all know I don't ever really do color so I love the fact that it has like the orange in it it looks really really cute um, and I love the black and white checkered as well which is like you know like the same as my kitchen so I love that so this is the reef we'll be using for the door now I don't know if I'll use this um garland right here but this is some garland that I end up getting from Hobby Lobby um that I was thinking about using I might use this or I might not if I do I just kind of want to hang it on each side of the door but that's pretty much it on that um I have two of these and these were actually $13.99 but they were 50% off so um I got them half off and then we have some little straw bell um, that we're going to put outside. So I have a big one and then I have a small one. Uh, I think the big one was, yeah, $13.99 and then, then the small one was $5.99 when I got it from Hobby Lobby and I got them half off. We're going to use this and then I also have a small one too as well. And then next I have this pillow right here. This pillow did come from uh, Target. It was just for like $5. Um, I did get this a while back. I thought it was super cute and I, um, it was like little balls on it, but I took those off because I just want to use like the little checkered look and I do want to use this to actually put on my black chair outside. And then we have this welcome sign that we end up getting from Burlington. I believe it was $19.99. Super cute. And it also has like a little checkered bow up there as well. So yeah, I thought this was really cute. And I actually love the font on here as well. And I just love the little bow. So I can't wait to put this outside. This is really cute. And then next, guys, I'm actually going to use my lanterns um, that I end up getting from... I think these came from the at-home store and they were actually on sale, so like they were half off. The original price was, I think, $27, so I got two of these, and they're like really tall, so I think they'll go really cute on the porch. And then I have this Home Sweet Home mat that came from Hobby Lobby. I think it was about $15, and I ended up getting it half off, so this is the mat that we're going to use for the outside. Under the mat, I'm going to be using this cute little checkered rug right here to just keep that checkered theme going as well. So guys, that is everything that we are going to be decorating the front porch with today. So I'm super excited to decorate today. The weather is perfect. It is literally giving fall vibes. It's like a little bit on a chilly side, so I'm excited. I got like my little cute little um, green dress, but you guys will see it um, once I decorate and stuff like that. So also I got some pumpkins, some real pumpkins. So I have some real orange pumpkins to decorate outside for like the straw and stuff like that to kind of like put it around there and like put like a few on the porch. So yeah, I'm excited. So let's get the following hey guys so real quick i wanted to show you guys how it looks outside uh what i did was i did go ahead and add my little black and white rug that i ended up doing last year as well um which the rug ended up coming from mm, walmart i believe and then um i did go ahead and uh put home right here with some stickers last year it said the style by imani initial so i did switch it this year but so far this is like what we are um working with is giving real fall out here porch still looks absolutely gorgeous um i love that black it's just gonna really pop so pretty with the fall decor i am so excited so yeah i just want to show you guys how it looks right now
Okay guys, so this is how everything is looking right now. I think it looks super cute. What I did was I ended up taking the two black pumpkins and sitting on top of the smaller bell instead of putting it um, on the side. I just feel like they stick out more when they're on top. It looks super cute. Um, so let's go ahead and let you guys know where everything's from, which I pretty much already told y'all, but real quick, let's get some close-ups real quick. I think everything turned out so cute. It's definitely giving a fall vibes for sure. Like, I love this. It looks so cute. I want you guys to comment and let me know. Do you guys have like the same color scheme? It looks super cute. So, um, the rug came from Walmart. I believe the rug was actually $50. And then the checkered rug behind there, Hobby Lobby. I think it was like $10 and then this rug right here was like $15 but it was half off. The pumpkins over here I ended up getting from Kroger's. They were actually $5 a piece so I ended up getting three of them. It was like $15. And these are some little black pumpkins that I ended up getting from Hobby Lobby. They were $2.50 a piece. The small bill was $5.99. The big bill was $13.99. This is my black chair. I ended up getting this black chair from Amazon. I actually had a set. And y'all, I'm not gonna lie, I kind of regret throwing away or give my um other little chair away after like spray painting i shouldn't have never tried to spray paint it white it was not necessary <laughs> um and just having my black chair here just lets me know just how unnecessary it was to try to paint that chair black um i love these chairs so i just got one chair now <laughs> i might buy some more i'm not sure but amazon came in a set i'll link it below if you guys want it um the welcome sign look is super cute this came from burlington and it was 19.99 and then we have the lanterns right here, which came from the at-home store, and they were half off of $27. Okay. And then this garland right here ended up coming from, I believe, Hobby Lobby. Um, and it was $13 and some change. And it was also half off as well. And then the garland ended up coming from Burlington. And it was $24.99. It looks so cute. Also guys, these stickers that I um, put on here, these stickers actually came from Hobby Lobby um, and I got like a whole pack of them. So they're super cute, I love these. I want you guys to comment and let me know, like do you guys ever put these stickers on your door? I just love to go, y'all know, I love it. And y'all, the porch is holding up so good from the black, y'all, it looks so good. Oh my God, are you kidding? Y'all, it looks so good, I cannot. Literally, oh my God. So basically, if you don't know, I um, painted my porch black. It was like a gray color at first, but I did paint it like a black. Y'all, this black is like perfect. Like I was so worried about it blending in with the door. Like it looks amazing. Like, are you kidding? Like, are you kidding? It looks so good. But anyways, um, it's still holding up. Um, we haven't had any peeling or anything, but we'll see how long it holds up throughout the winter, etc. Because like I said, my last paint ended up peeling, so we'll see how this actually holds up. But definitely, the black porch is a win. Um, I'll probably keep it this color pretty much forever. I don't see the need to actually paint this another color because the black just goes good with my house and then also my door as well. So I want you guys to comment let me know what you guys think. And if you guys like the way everything came together. Okay, y'all. So, what are we thinking? First of all, let me just say I am so glad that I added a color to the decor in the front porch today. Um, the orange color just really sit well with my spirit. Um, it's really giving fall, y'all. I'm really excited for the um, front porch. So, I want you guys to comment and let me know what do you guys think about the front porch? How do you guys think it turns out? It's just giving so many fall vibes. I'm very excited. Everything turned out the way that I visioned it. Um, you guys know that I love decorating. I love creating. I hope you guys were able to get some inspiration out of today's video. And I hope you guys also enjoyed the vlog. I want you guys to comment and let me know which part of the video was your favorite. Also, do you guys like my color scheme? And do you guys also have the similar color scheme with the checkered buffalo look as well? Also, are you guys decorating with real pumpkins um, for this fall season that was definitely something new that i did this year because i had never decorated with the real pumpkins or whatever so you know i thought that was cute plus it just made it just look more realistic with the pumpkins and then also the bell too as well that was my first time using that so yeah 
I want you guys to comment and let me know. And I also want you guys to give this video a thumbs up if you guys got some inspiration and if you guys got some ideas. And also, if you guys like the video, it helps out my video a lot. I want you guys to comment below your thoughts. I love you guys, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys. Bye.